And today we're going to be talking about this super cool little bench top wood lathe right here. So what we're going to do is I'm going to bring the camera in closer and I'm going to show you guys some of the specs and features of this lathe. Let's get into it. Okay, so here she is in all her glory. This lathe is made out of cast iron, so it's extremely sturdy, extremely tough. You can see from the sticker here, it is 110 volts, one third horsepower. You can vary your RPMs from 750 all the way up to 3200. You can put a piece of stock in here up to 12 inches long and eight inches in diameter. And it's got the one inch 8 TPI spindle here. Plus some of the things you have as well is your tool rest is fully adjustable. You can lock it down in pretty much any direction that you need to. And check this out on your tool rest. Say if you were trying to tighten up your tool, but you were having clearance issues and you couldn't tighten it up all the way. You can actually pull this, rotate it back, tighten it, pull it, rotate it back, and tighten it. And it's like a ratchet style, so you never have interference issues when you're trying to tighten up your tool rest. Now you can slide the tail piece up and down as well. And you can also use drill bits in here for hollowing out certain items, but you also get the spindle as well for the back. So very, very cool. And you can of course lock that in there, no issues whatsoever. The face plate is a six inch face plate. And you can see here's a piece that we've been turning on it right here. So you can see that it works quite nicely. You also have your front spindle here for locking in the wood. It goes in there, but you can also screw the face plate on there as well. So tons of options and tons of, tons of features. You get the wrenches and the tools with it, but uh, overall a very, very nice lathe. Here's some other pieces that we were able to make. You can see we have a little wooden mushroom and this was made on this same exact lathe. We have this little mini goblet as well. Very cool. And here's a larger one that's in process. So very, very capable and very convenient for the fact that it runs off 110 and it's light enough to be moved onto a bench and off of a bench. So you don't have to have a dedicated space just for the lathe. And you can adjust your RPMs to infinity, basically anywhere from 750 to 32, you can turn it down as much as you want or turn it up as much as you want. And just overall, a very solid wood lathe. So overall, a very good wood lathe. It's great for beginners, it's great for intermediate users, or even pros if you just need a smaller lathe in your shop. And it's very, very capable. And with the heavy duty construction, you're gonna get years of good use out of this lathe. I hope this video helps, and thanks for watching.